Hi guys and welcome back to the channel. Quite a lot has been going on with the Inquisitor Master Squad. There have been many ups and downs recently, from Gabby and others leaving, Jack's disappearing to Zack and Alex breaking up just shy of their wedding announcement. Today we'll be discussing Drake and all that he has gone through on the Inquisitor Master Squad. Drake has probably received the most abuse on the squad, even more than Zack after all Alex took so much advantage of Drake's talents and ultimately kicked him out of the squad all while portraying that he left the squad on his own. While the time has come for the truth of what really went down between Drake and the squad or actually, particularly between Drake and Alex as Drake has finally come out against Alex and revealed the horrors he had to go through on the squad because of her. In this video we'll be taking a look at everything Drake had to say about Alex and it is shocking. To say the least, so stay tuned and watch. So first, who is the Inquisitor Master? Inquisitor Master is a famous YouTube gamer and cosplayer. She is 27 years old, born on May 1, 1994, in the United States and her birth name is Alex Einstein. Inquisitor Master gained fame through her comedic gameplay commentaries for Yandere Simulator, Roblox, and a variety of other games that have gained over 5 million subscribers. She posts content related to popular video games such as Roblox, Yandere Simulator, Pokemon Go, and Call of Duty. Her commentaries are funny, sarcastic, and humorous that has made her one of the top gaming commentators on social media. Besides having over 5.6 million subscribers on YouTube, she has a decent fan following on other different social platforms as well. She posts role plays, challenges, and other types of content on well-known games. She formerly called her fanbase Starkies. She often films videos with the squad, which is formed by Alex herself. The members included Zack, Drake, Jade, Light, Jax, Charlie, Sora, Luca, and Levy. She has also raised money for causes like St. Jude. She began her career on YouTube by playing other games, but since then, she predominantly plays Among Us and some Roblox games. Who is Drake? Drake's real name is Reese Todd and Zack is his twin brother. Drake is a former member of the squad. He made his debut in the first video of the squad in January 2020. Drake is shown to be bold, sometimes silent, smart, and funny. He almost always cheats and hide and seek with the squad and sometimes ditches the others for Zack. Drake is cheeky at times, such as mocking the other members. So now that we have our bases covered, let us move on to the real problem at hand. What's up with everyone on the Inquisitor Master Squad exposing one another recently? It seems as if everyone wants to put the blame on the other for all the messes on the Inquisitor Master Squad. Everyone from Drake to Gabby to Zack and Alex is on a streak of exposing each other. They can't stop bringing up a new drama every week. It's no surprise that Inquisitor Master fans are both worried and intrigued by what's going on with the squad after the whole situation with Zalex. As we all remember, the breakup between Zack and Alex basically tore apart the Inquisitor Master Squad. After a relationship of five years, seemingly heading onto the track of marriage, which they both basically confirmed, they broke up out of nowhere. The story got even more twisted as it was revealed that Alex never even liked Zack from the moment they met. She actually admitted it. Alex had a grand idea for a YouTube channel, and she felt like Zack was the ideal guy to bring onto her team for this new project, and she started concocting a plan to get him involved. The whole thing was kind of a setup from the start. With Zack heartbroken, knowing now that Alex never cared for him and simply used him. He went on to create his own squad, the Z Squad. With fans still reeling in with this major event going down on the Inquisitor Master Squad, more tensions with other members keep them on edge. Will the Inquisitor Master Squad even survive at the end of this? Well, Drake continues to amp up the pressure as he drops more information and details on how Alex treated him. For the rest of the squad, these latest rumors and revelations about Alex completely expose her for all the wrongdoings on the squad. Who knows, after Drake, maybe other members will also get the courage to speak up. Let's take a look at what Drake has to say about Alex. It's really shocking Alex uses talents and manipulation tactics to her advantage. According to Drake, Alex rarely knows how to run a squad properly. There were rumors initially about Alex running the squad with an iron fist she used to dominate over squad members, requiring them to follow certain rules and obey what Alex had to say. One thing is for sure, and that is that Alex picked the finest people for her crew and picked the best members for her squad, the most talented individuals. However, it won't matter how good your members are if all of them are run down, 
overworked, and demotivated. Alex used to run the squad without giving much freedom to the squad members. They were expected to work on demand and perform all the tasks dutifully without questioning her ever. Drake further went on to claim that fans see the softer and nicer side of Inquisitor Master Alex when she's on camera, and what they really don't know is how terrible she acts behind the scenes. He says she is a horrible person that swears and abuses her teammates if things go wrong, rather than being a supportive leader. This made the twins want to separate from the squad. Drake has another shocking revelation to make about Inquisitor Master Alex. According to Drake, Alex was jealous of the twins bonding on camera. She hated that Drake and Zack stole the limelight and that fans loved them more than her. Drake reveals that she wanted to separate the twins on several occasions, but didn't get the chance to do so. Thanks to how popular the twins were on the squad, Alex finally got the opportunity to get the upper hand on them when the rumors of Zaki's cheating got out. Alex now has the opportunity to get rid of both the twins and it's seen for good. It's safe to assume that she didn't expect in her wildest dreams thought that the squad could break up because of what she was doing. According to Drake, Alex is a terrible person for trying to separate him from Zack. Drake sincerely wanted to help Alex and make the Inquisitor squad run smoothly to improve the experience for everyone, and he gave Alex advice on how to do exactly that. However, she took advantage of the advice he gave her regarding running the squad properly and ignored his advice. According to Drake, he offered Alex so much advice and honestly wanted to help her run the squad efficiently and properly. He wanted the squad to be his as much as it belonged to Alex besides the squad members loved and listened to Drake, however, Inquisitor Master Alex herself seemed to have an attitude problem and ignored every advice Drake tried to give her. She took his kindness for granted. Not only that, but Drake even revealed how Alex would ignore Gabby, her best friend, and not listen to any advice and help she offered after all they were the senior squad members and deserved to have a say in the decisions of the squad. Alex did not believe this and thought that she was the head and no one else had any right to say a thing to her regarding how the squad should be run hated his relationship with Gabby Drake. Also reveals that Alex had a serious problem with his and Gabby's relationship, and this problem was right from when the squad was created maybe the hatred had to do with Drake being more popular than Zack, and as such a relationship with Zack and Gabby would be more popular than hers and Zacky's relationship. Now this might sound silly to most of you, for Alex to be jealous of Drake and Gabby for such a reason. But if you remember Alex had a serious problem when Gabby announced she's getting married to Drake. Before it seems that Alex is jealous of Gabby and the fact that Drake is the one who's friendly with her best friend made it even worse. On the Inquisitor Master's problem with spreading false rumors finally, Drake reveals that Alex constantly spread fake rumors about him and Zack. She did this just so she could break up with Zack and point Drake in a bad light. So will you fans believe this, and do you think that Alex is as self-centered and jealous as Drake portrays? Let us know in the comment section below, and feel free to throw any other of your thoughts and questions on there too. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.